10. That is when the city facing bankruptcy had to stop its residential street sweeping program. Today, community leaders like Councilman Scott Benson gathered at Kempa and Bliss Streets on Detroit's east side to announce the program is back up and running. It sends the residents that city services are back, that we're doing the things that they demand and the things that they deserve. I got to ride along with one man who says he has never felt so popular. Sharom Ivory has worked for the city for 23 years. As he drives the sweeper, at times, crowds are coming out to thank him. They are out uh, calling and saying, hey, thank y'all so much. I had a guy uh, tell me the other day, he says, you know what, this is, I'm so glad to see something coming to the neighborhood, something great coming to the neighborhood because we haven't had this done in years. The city bought eight new sweepers. The plan is to have them clean all streets three times a year. The cost of the program is about $1.7 million. This is huge on multiple facets. One, um, keeps the catch basins clean and the sewers clean. It also brings pride of ownership to the residents. To see all of the new thing that's happening, the new businesses, man, it's just like a great thing to be able to be a part of. So how will you know when the street sweepers will be on your street cleaning it up? Well, two days ahead of time, you will see signs like this along the road asking you to please not park on the street so they can do their jobs. In Detroit, Kim Russell, The Now Detroit.